New PB gold medal. Got to be super pumped. How did that feel? Uh, felt great. Um, actually, didn't hurt as bad as I thought it would have. It did hurt, though. Don't get me wrong. But usually, 400s hurt a little bit more. Um, I was able to execute it the way I wanted to. Um, the only way I thought that I could have won it was that way. And I was able to do it. So, yeah, I'm very, very proud and happy with the performance. On the last lap, Trevor tried to come by, you know, come into that right before that final turn, and you held him off. You think that was the key to the victory? Definitely, definitely. Those guys are course 400 meter guys. Um, my biggest advantage was the speed, and I had to use it and control the front, and that's exactly why I did. But I expected them to be coming at the end, and they wasn't gonna let it be easy for me. And I even saw, I don't like to look at social media when I like when I'm when I'm about to run, but I even saw Tre Trevor. Um, he told Flow Track that he's gonna run 44 and win. And I, in my mind, I was like, well, if he if he needs to run 44 to win, then I need to run 44 to win. So um, I saw it and it was just kind of motivation for me going forward. All right, what can we look for outdoors? Thank you very much. This must have been an, uh, an emotional victory for you because of the passing of Dion Lindor. Was this an extra motivation to win the gold for him? Definitely an uh, extra motivation. Dion was one of the pioneers of my generation. He motivated uh, a lot of us in Trinidad and Tobago proved to us that it's possible to run fast, it's possible to run fast and get an education and to be a, prof a professional athlete. So um, with the passing of him, you know, I just wanted to come out here and make him proud. Also, I lost my grandmom. I lost my, uh, my grandfather's brother um, earlier this year um, too also. So, um, you know, with all that on my mind, I just wanted to go out there and perform and make them proud. Thanks so much. Congrats on the goals. Thank you.